Okay, we are back. Me and Abby are back. So, now let's go back to what she said. Um, when I said, yeah, put in your information on um, may harm you, but is that what the say so for? She wrote, she, I am back saying, agreed, but these are those people out there, but there are people are out there who you there for the instance, putting up the info doesn't necessarily harm you. There are not just whole of people out there who get a kick out of holding people harm you. They see an address, a phone number, as an opportunity. Yes, they may see the opportunity. They may see it as an opportunity, but that is your phone number. That is your address. If they try to call you, guess what? Call the police. Call someone to help you. All right. If they come to your house once again, call someone to help you. All right. That is, in my opinion, simple. Moving on. She be she um. She is um. I mean, she wrote back. Yes, sir. You you most certainly can. In most cases, I myself has seen some pretty nasty thing happen to people because of this sort of thing. Once bad things happen, even if they are flexible, it is so ruined, either for the moment or a prolonged period, prolonged period of time. Don't get me wrong, social network, networking sites are great, but they are one in a million chance it will happen to you. Yes, it will happen to you, but if something happened to you, it, they are fixable, alright? And nothing, if you, when you fix it, then it won't be on your history. What will be on your history is you got fraud. I mean, not fraud. Wrong one. That you, that someone hacked into your his, into your identity. So I'm gonna, I am her back. Yes, it is fixable. All what people will see is you had someone see your identity. That is all. Even Paige, at, uh, as an author, she wrote, uh, she responded, even paying a bird or dying a phone or typing on a keyboard is professionally harmful. That's correct. Uh, that is why I have a hard time putting, I mean, paying birds online, alright? Now, dying on your phone or typing on the keyboard, I kind of totally get confused. How can that be harmful? So, I will, I am her saying, how can dying on a phone and typing on a keyboard be harmful because we are taping right now all right because if she, if he said i mean if she said taping on the keyboard well i'm taping on the keyboard she taping on the keyboard in this aim debate now she just responded in most cases yes but in some cases like apply applying for a permit a car loan Things like that. They see something happen and can't say if it real or fake. That is kind of wrong because if they see something happen, all right, but then it got it got fixed because it's not you. They got fixed. Boom. All right. What people these days leave their electronics everywhere. My, I myself leave my laptop and sometimes my phone in the lobby when I'm waiting for a train. And that is when that is her response for another thing. So, but actually I do have a response for the uh, apartment thing. So I'm going to write my response of the apartment thing. Thing is most of the time if it is fraud or something like that and you get up by the police, I would most likely think 
they will fix it. Most likely. Alright, so, so yes, I know you get flogged, your identity get hacked in. Yes, but if you get hurt by the police, most likely I will believe, I hopefully think it will um, get fixed because you didn't do it. So I will hopefully it get fixed. And about her leaving electronic, who far is that? So let me um, respond to her, put my pen down, about leaving everything. Who far is that? Alright. So let me move up to AIM because she um, responded. Okay, she responded. Well, most people did. Oh no, I already said that. Right here. It takes less than a half a minute to install a bug or even a keystroke recorder. Which is you to record every single thing you do on a keyboard, which is then throw through the password. Throw through for password. Online banking and for banking. A bank account number. Yes, that is true. But. Then you get hurt, and then everything will slowly get fixed, and you will be okay. Moving on, because she um, responded. It may seem unreal and from the movie, but it's happened. Yes, I totally agree. All right, it's not only in movie; it is real. People are getting from an identity thief that, but. It really is happened. So if you guys think it's only in movie, why? It is really in movies. I mean, it's in movie, but it really is in real life. Moving down because she responded. I agree, Eric. Most time, but the economy and all is going through tough time. People will, will f f uh, first they sold an identity to cover up a fake identity to get what they want. It your it your fault, but you done. But don't know to things until it happened. And besides, when you left it for those two minutes, you didn't think or expect something, something to try, someone to try, stuff like that. The whole people and are generally good till they prove they aren't good. All right, here there, there, there are a couple of things that I totally. Uh, that I agree, I disagree. Yes, yeah, so, so, yeah, the economy may be going through a tough time, but if you are willing to put someone in a bad sp space because the economy is bad, then guess what? You deserve to be dead and out of this country. I'm sorry, but that's my personal opinion. So let me respond to her. If someone is, um, if someone is willing, to put someone down because the economy is bad, then you should be dead or out of this country. That is hard, but I think that. I mean, I can say my opinion or c could be hot, but sometimes my opinion, if you think about it, is 100% true. Alright, so, it your fault, but you don't know. Yes, you don't know, but you don't know, but why are you leaving yourself down in the train station? Alright? Double thing. Would I ever leave a phone or something in the train station? I'm sorry. I, tr I trust everyone, but I would never leave my phone or laptop or anything in a phone station. Me trusting everyone until they distrust me, I will not, I, I won't leave anything in the train station. That's just for my opinion. Alright, so, and back to what she responded, yes, you don't, you didn't think uh, expect anyone to do that stuff? Well, you have to think everyone is different. 
Alright, everyone is different, and...